Okay, I question for you, what is the connection between getting a caffeine fix, radical Islam, and pushing out the gospel? Well, if you know anything about me and about ICC, we're passionate about pushing out the gospel into, into the toughest areas in the world. So let me tell you about one of these businesses. It's a, it's a cafe in Indonesia, uh, and we didn't start it, but this, this owner really got our attention because they were so focused on the gospel. And they were running a good business and seeing a lot of success spiritually. And then COVID, uh, the government shut everything down, including the cafe. Now here's the cool thing though, the owner says, you know, I can't sell product, but I'm gonna keep up spiritually. And so they started a Bible study and uh, one of her employees comes to Christ. She's being exposed to the Bible through this uh, book study, but being exposed to the Bible and, and just drawn to it. And then this girl comes to Christ and, she, and the owner just sees all kinds of life change. It's like, this is real, it's so cool to watch. Um, and then though, that same person, that same convert says, you know what, I've kind of been hidden in my faith and I want to go public. And she says, I want to get baptized. And that's often a very dangerous point for a convert, depending on how uh, fundamental the country is. It can even mean their death, uh, torture, etc. Uh, so anyway, she isn't in that kind of danger, but she's now receiving a lot of pressure from her husband, from her family, from her parents uh, to convert. She has no intention to convert back. Uh, but that's the pressure she's receiving. So her main prayer request in all this though, this is really cool and it shows you her heart. Her main prayer request is that her parents would come to Christ. Uh, so for us, we would say, hey, let's also pray for her safety, uh, but not to lose that bold spirit. We love that. And we love finding these people all over the world that they'll risk everything because they're so driven uh, to share with the world what they found, the answer to life. So God bless you for partnering with this work.